What's going on everybody, Jason here, and today I've got a very, very special truck for you. This is the 2021 Ram 1500 Bighorn. Not any other Bighorn, it's the Mopar 21 Edition. Now, with this Mopar 21 Edition, there is only 250 units in North America that were ever made. 40 of those came to Canada, and you're looking at one of them, which is in the beautiful flame red. And this being only 250 units, you can consider this more rare than a Ram TRX and even a McLaren P1 since they only built like 375 units. This only 250. With a $10,000 price tag on this Mopar 21 edition package, let's go over what it features. So starting off with the colors, you can only get four colors. Number one, which you're looking at is the flame red. The second one is the billet silver, third bright white, and the last one is the beautiful hydro blue. And just by looking at the truck from the front, you can see a lot of distinctive features that this uh, particular big horn carries over from like the Sport, Rebel, and other trucks. For example, which I'll cover in a second, with the Mopar 21 edition, you'll get gloss black grill, black exhaust tips, badges, Mopar seat logo, Moly bags and straps, off-road style running boards, sprain liner, adjustable tie-down hooks, tow hooks in the front, dual trailer camera prep, one piece tonal cover and all weather mats. Also with this, you'll get an owner's kit in a custom box. And this Mopar 21 package is packaged on top of the Ram 1500 Bighorn, which obviously gives you 20 inch black wheels, body color bumper and fender flares with the black mirrors. So starting off in the front, you can just see you get the body colored bumper. Uh, let's start off at the bottom. You'll get the tow hooks in black on both sides. And of course your LED fog lights, of course, both sides along with your LED headlamps and with that beautiful beautiful gloss black grill in the center and of course this trim in black as well right above the headlights that goes all the way around also on this you get parking sensors which go all along you can see right there and you get the beautiful ram logo blacked out as well of course why not and on this one as well you get the sports performance hood which you know carries on from the sport models and i think it looks very very unique obviously with the hood venting which obviously is not functional it would be cool if it was but then you also get the 1500 badging with the Hemi 5.7 logo as well. And looking at it from the side, you can see very, very distinctive features that make this the Mopar 21 edition, of course. Like I mentioned, you get the black wheels, the off-road running style side steps, and then you get that nice stripe which shows RAM, and then it just goes all the way along, which I'll show you. And of course, you get these beautiful gloss black side mirrors. As for the wheels themselves, these are 20 inch, kind of you can say, matte black finished wheels which look absolutely beautiful and just go along with the whole blacked out theme of the truck also very very unique to the mopar 21 edition is you do get a raised height as well compared to a normal bighorn and of course moving over to the rear like i mentioned that black graphic goes all the way along over your one piece tonal cover which i'll cover and you get your led rear lighting with your black sensor in the middle of course on the bottom you've got your step to get in and out of your bed body colored rear bumpers and of course more of your built-in sensors in the rear and this being a bighorn you get bighorn blacked out along with the ram badging blacked out as well and then of course 4x4 and just like any other ram you've got your built-in backup camera to the tailgate button right there over along on the sides you get dual exhaust of course but these are painted black which look absolutely beautiful you've got your uh, hitch receiver right here along with the typical plugs that you would normally get Right here is your trailer camera towing um, wiring and all of that stuff. So you get both right here, ready to go. Now, looking at this one piece tonal cover, I think it looks very, very nice. This is very unique because you cannot get this on any other Ram and you've got that stripe going all along. And just to open this, you're going to twist this. And of course it lifts off because it has two um, gas shocks that does uh, hold it up as well. You get this nice strap to obviously pull it down if you're too short and two extra set of keys. Also on this, you get a spray and bed liner with the adjustable tie down hooks, uh, two on each side. And just like any other Ram, you get the built in uh, actual hooks into the truck on all four corners. Opening up the tailgate to make it a little bit easier. Um, also, you get LED bed lighting on both sides and you've got a button here to turn it on and off manually. So to shut all of this together, you're gonna close your tailgate and then pull this down right here. 
and that's it. Also, you can see all along the wheels, you do get these fender flares, which are body color, and it just makes the truck look a little bit more, I guess you can say sporty, stylish, aggressive, whatever you want to call it. As for the key itself, a very traditional Ram key. You've got your unlock, lock, remote start, panic button, and then your Ram logo at the back. And to hear what this bad boy sounds like, you're gonna double tap, give it a second, and the Mopar 21 edition comes to life. And of course, as for the engine, this is your 5.7 Hemi V8 engine, which is going to give you 395 horsepower with 410 foot-pound of torque. And these are what the off-road side steps look like. They look very, very aggressive and you know ready to take on any terrain pretty much. Heading into the truck in the rear, looking at the door right here, You've got all black material, of course, and then you've got this uh, shiny metallic kind of a trim that goes all inside of the truck, which looks very, very unique and very, very nice. You've also got this cloth insert, which obviously makes it a little bit more unique and styling, and then silver trim that goes all the way around. You've got a little bit of space here, here, and here for your cup holders. And you've got a speaker here, part of your nine Alpine speakers, which this truck has. You've got a nice looking in like silver aluminum uh, badging, the Ram logo on the door sills. Very, very nice. Also at the bottom on both sides, you do have in-floor storage bins to put whatever you need to. Very, very nice to have, especially if you're going on a long trip with the family. Behind both the driver and passenger seating, you get this nice netting design. Kind of reminds me of the Wranglers uh, with the Rubicons, but uh, you do get a little bit of space on both sides to put small things. In the center here, you've got more of this shiny material that goes all the way along. Looks very, very premium. And in the center here, you've got a 115 volt plug, uh, USB ports normal and type C, and then cup holders up top. As for the rear seats themselves, they are leather and then the middle section is cloth. Um, again, this uh, reminds me of a sport. Uh, this is what they would typically come with. So this is kind of a mix between a bighorn sport and all of that. But again, very, very nice seats. And then if you look in the center here, just like any other Ram, you've got two cup holders in the center here. Of course, you've got your uh, rear power sliding window and then more speakers for your Alpine sound system. Heading over to the front driver's side. Again, the door is the exact same as the rear with the shiny material, cloth, and just all black everywhere with space here, 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 and for two cup holders. And of course your speakers for the Alpine system. Also at the bottom, you do get a little bit of a larger Ram logo in the kind of like a silver metallic finish. Underneath, nothing too special, just your foot pedals. In between here, you've got your hood latch release, your electronic parking brake, and then your um, foot pedals are power adjustable. You've got your lighting controls here with the fog lights and then your rear lights in the bed and then any of your dimmers and then your steering wheel is manual adjustable. And here's where more of that Mopar 21 uniqueness comes out of. These seats are the exact same as the rear. You get leather and then cloth inserts, but you get Mopar stitching logo in the seats, both sides in the front. Uh, very, very nice and very unique, especially in that blue contrast. As for the interior of this Mopar 21 Bighorn Edition, the vents, uh, of course, all around do have this nice, dark, shiny metallic finish, which looks very, very premium. Up top on the dash, you get uh, plastic all around, all in black, of course. And then you've got your speakers there, here, and in that corner down there. In the center here, you've got another Ram logo and more of that black, shiny material that goes all the way around. As for the steering wheel, it's in leather. Uh, very, very nice and very good feeling um, all along the Controls right here, you've got more of that uh, metallic finish that goes everywhere. You've got controls for your center gauge cluster, Bluetooth, and then your cruise control settings. And right here, you've got controls for your gear limit selection. And then you can't forget about your Ram logo right in the center. In the center gauge cluster, very, very similar to any other Ram out there. You've got your Ram logo up top. You've got your talk meter here, speed over there, and all of that stuff. And of course, in the center, you can kind of flick through uh, different options, whichever you, you know, whatever you want to look at. So you can go through all of the vehicle information, audio, and all of that good stuff. Of course, this is push to start. Why wouldn't it be? You've got your uh, gear selector knob here. It is in black, uh, which is very, very unique as well. Um, you've got your off-road settings here, and then you've got your hill descent control and then axle lock button right there. In the center, hand rest right here. It's full leather with kind of like a silver stitching. If you open up the first section, you've got a decent amount of room in here with a USB port if you want to leave something in here to charge overnight or, you know, while you're driving. 
right on the second section you've got measuring tools right there and a ton a ton of room as you've probably noticed from my previous ram 1500 videos uh you've got this slider that slides back and forth and more room in the middle section there of course on the actual slider you've got a little bit of room here and your cup holders over at the bottom here you've got 115 volt plug as well and then you've got your phone holders here you've got two phone holders you've got a little bit of room here and of course more usb ports normal ones type c and then your aux cable as well right above that you've got your front and rear parking sensors tow mode and then your traction control right there now something very very unique to this particular bighorn in the mopar 21 edition this comes with the massive 12 inch screen typically you will not find this in a bighorn this is very very unique just to this package and i'll do a quick quick rundown because i've done many videos on this 12 inch screen um but if this is your first time watching you've got controls over here for your venting and cooling um you've got your media section here on the screen and then if you press controls right here you can access your heated seats heated steering wheel and then heated seats on the driver's side and then mirror dimmer and then your backup camera which shows up here and you can zoom in and out uh, from there also you've got climate so if you don't want to use these buttons here you can do everything through the touch screen you've got your apps section right there navigation very very nice this is actually you can either have full screen or a dual screen which i'll show you you have your phone setting and then your backup camera right there so if you press home you can kind of configure what you want half and half so let's say you want navigation up top and then at the bottom you want media you can have the best of both worlds on this above that you've got your dimmable mirror of course and right up top here you've got your interior lighting uh assist and sos buttons a little bit of storage here for your sunglasses or whatnot and then your rear power sliding button right there for your window coming over to the passenger side again you can see these beautiful seats with the mopar logo of course and then you've got a little bit of space here on both sides your glove department you've got a decent amount of room in here if that's not enough you're going to open up your second one and have more room in there now you've got more badging here this one is number 200 of 250 so these are numbered trucks very very nice i'm not sure if you'll be able to see this with the glare but this is the 2021 ram 1500 with the mopar 21 package again you can see uh, the regular specs standard features and then optional right here you've got your mopar 21 package all of the stuff that's included goes all along here bighorn level 2 equipment and a few more things very very nice package and it has a lot of stuff and that's it for this ram 1500 bighorn 21 mopar edition let me know in the comments down below if you love it or if you hate it